All right, all you FM9 owners, this is the news you have been waiting for. FM9 firmware version 5.00 public beta 1 came out 26 minutes ago. The update process is similar to that for the XFX3 and the FM3. You would download the latest FractalBot and the latest FM9 edit. Install those, then load the FM9 firmware, reboot the FM9 when it's done, you'll get a message saying Dynacabs haven't been loaded, load the Dynacabs in the same way you'd load a regular firmware file, do another reboot, and then go into FM9, I do believe it's settings, either settings or tools, and do refresh after new firmware. You should have Dynacabs then. But here are the new features. Dynacabs have been added. The cabinet block now has two modes of operation, Legacy and Dynacab. Amp block now features auto Dynacab impedance. Added speaker impedance curves for 2x12 Class A 30 watt silver, 2x10 Hartke, and 4x12 1960 BV. Added 4 band JM Pre 1 type to graphic EQ block. And then added the Rev Gen amp models based on a Rev Generator 120. There are three models for each of the purple, red, and green channel. There was one update, drive effect default input select setting is changed to left, and one fix, FC. Edit set list page on the front panel will now refresh appropriately when inserting slash deleting songs. So I will have the links for the new version of FM9 Edit, the new version of FractalBot, and for the FM9 firmware. Those will all be in the description. All right, guys, have a great Tuesday, and I will see you tomorrow.